After five games of Pac-10 play, the conference is pretty much a hot mess. Every team has won at least two games and lost at least two. The Washington State Cougars had lost three times heading into today's game against Stanford, so they needed a win at home to stay with the rest of the jumbled Pac-10. Cougar fans hoping their team can salvage a weekend split after losing to Cal on Thursday. Stanford opened up hot. Landry Fields gets the pass and finishes with the slam. Cardinals start on a 10-2 run. Cougs answer back. Clay Thompson finding his shooting stroke. That's three straight points. Then Marcus Capers in transition. The strong finish. That's five in a row for the Cougs. Another Thompson three made it eight straight. Then Nick Koprovica add three more to the pile. He had 10 points. Cougs on an 11-0 run to take a three-point lead. They'd add on to it. Freshman Reggie Moore to sophomore D'Angelo Castro to lay in. Makes it an 11-point game. Cougs led by 20 at the half. Second stanza, Jeremy Green got hot. Three me. Cardinal on a 12-4 run to make it a 12-point game. Cougs pull away again. Thompson makes some space that hits the jumper. 11 of 20 from the field. The lead's back to six, but that green guy would not go away. Word to your moms, he came to drop bombs. He had 24. 15 came from beyond the arc. It's 64-57. The home team answered again. Marcus Capers believes he can fly. Another solid game, 10.7 boards. Then Thompson scored 27. This jumper makes it a seven-point game late. Stanford would get within two with less than a minute left, but Reggie Moore had seven of eight free throws to seal it. Cougs back to 500 in the Pac-10 with a four-point win. They didn't lose confidence when things got real close. All we knew is we had to get stops, and we went in panic because we were the team that was winning. And in situations like that, you just got to run your offense and take time off the clock and not free throws down as Reggie did.